In this video, I'm going to show you how to navigate the Biblio app. This is your Biblio library. From here, you can search and favorite books. Clicking on the yellow heart will move a book to the top of your library. Using the search bar at the top of the screen, you can search for keywords across all of your books in your library. You can also search only in your favorited books. The search function enables you to look for keywords within the content of the book, as well as figures. Clicking on an extract will direct you straight to the passage in the text. Clicking on any book in the library will direct you straight to the table of contents. A book can be navigated using the contents on the right hand side of the screen. Highlighting a passage of text will open a dialog box. From here, you can highlight a section of text and write comments. These will be saved to the cloud automatically. Clicking on the quotation mark button at the top of the reader will enable you to download your references into EndNote or RefWorks formats. In the dialog box, you can find the text-to-speech and speed reader functions. You can also increase the size of the text by zooming in. You can also enable flux and night mode, as well as setting custom colors to make the text easier to read. You can download the Biblio app either by scanning the QR code in the web browser, or you can visit biblio.com and click on platform. Here you'll find links to all of our apps. When using any of our native apps, to download a book, simply favorite the book by clicking on the heart, and then click on the download icon. Your book is now ready to read offline. If you encounter any issues when using the app, you can click on the support button from anywhere. Here, a member of the support team will be on hand to assist you with your query. If you have any updates that you'd like to see in the app, clicking on the rocket button will take you to the roadmap and request page. Here you can make suggestions and upvote features that you would like to see added to the app. You're now ready to start reading on Biblio.